YouTube. Hey YouTube. So this is going to be a video um, explaining to you guys where I'm at in my life with working for people. Um, I'm really sick of it. Um, right now, my job, I work for one of the uh, big company and we see maybe like 200 patients a day. We have um, minimal staff. Uh, as far as like check-in, we check in maybe like three patients wait it's three check-in people and we check in over 200 patients a day so if you do the math it's probably like 70 patients each person would have to check in if you you know take on your slack but you end up taking on other people's slack as well but the thing about this video is um follow your dreams everyone if you are younger even if you older make sure you set your dreams up to make it happen you i love this one quote you end up work you either work follow your dreams or end up working for somebody who did and i mean you know slavery is not in the same form but slavery i feel like i'm in slavery um i'm working just to pay my bills i'm working to just say i have a fucking house and just say i have a car and i mean you know what i'm saying as far as living i'm not doing that i don't have any money to live what what is living you know and it's so crazy because your work in a job you work and it's just so unappreciated you know um i go i don't really go past one year with jobs because i'm that person that'll make people like you know people at most of my jobs they be like oh we don't get raises every year and it's like what you know the fuck i'm getting a raise so um i'm one of those people that really don't make it past one year in the jobs because i'm not for bullshit you know i know my work ethics and i know my work ethic is one thousand percent and i don't accept anything other than that and i bring so much to the company and i am an asset and literally with this position that i'm in right now i literally got overwhelmed one day because they hired well they hired a girl that was below me and she did not have the experience she was literally at the front desk y'all like pimp did you check in pimp and i'm like the fuck is she here for <laughs> she was like pimp did you get your clipboard pimp what the, i mean it just got crazy like that and the thing that she did this was that just ticked me off the thing that she did was she bought everybody she figured out everybody i got so much lipstick on my teeth she figured out everybody birthday and she bought they ass something for their birthday the doctors the the doctor clinical assistant everybody of some statue stature at this place she bought him something and me and my hard work and my hard work ethic did not get compensated for my time so i was overwhelmed and you know what i did i cussed the, all the managers out i cussed all their asses out and i told them i demanded a raise and it was patients checking in and stuff and i'm on the managers like what the fuck y'all gonna do y'all gonna pay me some more money or what because i'm about to go what what is y'all gonna do you know i just went crazy and they like tiffany yeah come here we're gonna have you emergency um emergency meeting and you know you're gonna get compensated for your time because we love you you're doing a wonderful job but it's like bitch pay me shut up just shut up so um i'm going crazy if you would look at me <laughs> so um yeah just make sure you guys follow your dream don't don't put your dreams on hold don't put your dreams on hold for anybody follow your dreams they might have to be on hold because we do have to live we do have to nourish and feed ourselves and we do have to survive but make sure your dreams do not go on that back burner so much because you end up settling you know what i'm saying if we really get together and have our own businesses who needs to be waiting for medicare who needs to put money in 401k who needs to wait for somebody to give us a raise we get what we worth you know what i'm saying you feel you wake up one day like oh shit i'm gonna go up my, my prices man I, I feel like i'm better than that you know you can do it so make sure you guys just follow your dreams this is the main thing follow your dreams y'all follow whatever the fuck you want to do because if you don't you're gonna be fucking mad you, your whole life is gonna be hell you're gonna be living in hell because you never did what you're supposed to do and i mean that's just, just don't let that be y'all you know what i'm saying don't and if it is y'all do something about it it's never too late you know it's never too late follow your dreams um 
And if you think about it, whoever got rich working for somebody, you know what I'm saying? They're going to keep you in the same pay scale. And no matter how good of a job you get, it's always going to keep you at some level. So say, for instance, you get a job. Oh, you're making 60000 You went, You started making $20,000 a year, and then you started making 60000 a year. If, even if you get the 60000 you start a, getting a good car because, you know, you got this little better lifestyle and you end up see, being in the same boat. You're going to get a nicer house and you end up being in the same boat with the money left over because you start accommodating yourself to that lifestyle and you get accustomed to that lifestyle and you get comfortable. And it, and after you get comfortable, you, you you be happy at first, but then it start getting comfortable. And once you start getting comfortable, you're like, damn, this is some bullshit now. I need more. It's always more money to be got, and you're not going to get it working for nobody else. So this is the main thing. Follow y'all dreams, y'all. This I'm on my lunch break. I got to take my ass back in here. <laughs> but um, I'm following the dreams, too, so I'm working with y'all. So that's, that's a job. But, yeah, follow y'all dreams, y'all. And I love you guys, and I would definitely... You know, drop. I'm going to drop my portfolio because I'm having a fashion show coming up. I'm going to drop my clothes portfolio next. Um, that's going to be a video. When I get home, I'm going to show y'all my clothes that I make. And I'm just going to continue to follow my dreams because I cannot do this for longer. I go crazy. I literally go crazy every day. And it made me like my anxiety bad. And I'm just a bad person in general. Like, I cuss people out. I be in here with an attitude. I am angry. I'm a hot-headed person with, because of this job so make sure you guys just follow your dreams and i love you guys please drop your comments below thank you for watching thank you for liking my video thank you for subscribing to my channel and i love you guys and i will continue to motivate you guys so we gonna get this stuff together y'all because it's just that time it's time to get it together everybody so thank you guys for watching i love you guys have a good day and wish me luck when i take my ass back in <laughs> Thank y'all. I love y'all. And it's so crazy because you know what? It got so bad. I got to take a shot before I go to work. Like I go to the liquor store. People be like, what the fuck you? I go get liquor before work and get turned. Um, I can't go here sober. Sober? No. But um, I love you guys. I got to take my butt back from lunch. I love you. Y'all have a wonderful day, y'all. Bye.